Now to the state capitol, where there is a push for a change of power among Democratic lawmakers. One assembly member says that he has the votes to replace longtime speaker Anthony Rendon. KCRA3's Lizay Mitri joins us live from the capitol with the details. Lizay. Lisa, we talked to a political expert who described the speaker as one of the most powerful positions in California politics. They have control over the fate of legislation, over committees and who chairs them, for example. So the assembly met on the floor today, and this was the first time since assembly member Robert Rivas of Salinas put out a press release on Friday. Rivas announced he has enough support to become the next speaker to replace current speaker Anthony Rendon of Lakewood. Now we're waiting to see if there's actually a vote. Rendon has been speaker for the last six years and hasn't spoken publicly yet about this push among some Democrats for a change in leadership. We talked to a political analyst about why some of Rendon's fellow Democrats may want someone new in that position now. Progressives have been unhappy with Rendon about his uh, refusal to take a vote on um, uh, the, the universal health care bill, the single payer bill. Uh, there's also been some friction about his refusal to take up a vote on suspending the gas tax. So I think some progressives would like to see those things move forward, and that may be one reason why we're seeing this change now. Today, one item into the floor session, there were three different calls for a vote before lawmakers decided to recess for a caucus, putting the floor session on hold so Democrats could meet privately. That was around 2 o'clock. We're hearing they might be coming back out soon, um, but are still waiting to hear if they have actually made a decision and if we'll uh, hear about a vote today. Live here at the state capitol, Lizay Mitri, KCRA 3 News. So, Lizay, what do we know about the assembly member who wants to be the next speaker? Assembly member Robert Rivas is uh, fairly new. Uh, he's been representing the district, the 30th district for since 2018, uh, the rural district of Salinas. His grandfather was a farm worker and assembly member Rivas is the chair of the agriculture committee. All right, Lizay Mitri live from the Capitol. Thank you.